Hey, it's August 15th, 2023. It's almost six o'clock. Uh, I actually just am laying in my room right now, pretty chill. Um, <clears throat> now that I'm done on this uh, project, I just have all this free time. And uh, Blake drove out of town for work, so I'm home alone. I think about going to see a movie, but uh, I might go do that tomorrow. I had a Zoom call this morning for a project that's like in the future. <clears throat> so that's kind of cool. And then um, my friend Ryan, who writes for iHor, the one that uh, convinced me to do this vlog, <clears throat> flew out to Vegas today because he has been invited to the opening of the It-themed escape room in Vegas. So I'm jealous about that. I actually have a couple of other friends that posted that they're going. So they're all having fun there. And since it's quiet here today, I am just at home. I was watching TV, but it's really all about... Uh, I mean, the news, because, you know, the Trump indictment in Georgia, <clears throat> which is, like, crazy to begin with, because it's his fourth one. And so it, that's just, like, all over the news. So I am just sort of, like, flipping through channels, and I threw on Tubi. I watch a lot of stuff on Tubi. There's supposed to be some really good horror movies on Tubi. I might have to check one out today. Um, But, yeah, I mean, there's really, like, it's just been really, really quiet today. Uh, It's warm again this week, so I'm just keeping quiet. Uh, prepping for a couple of photo shoots that I have this week. Also, I was thinking, you know, I just did that photo shoot with Kevin and the photos look amazing. I really love them. And he's actually really happy with them too. And so I'm just trying to think of like which magazines I want to submit to. And there's one that I really, really want to, really want to submit to. Um, and I, I it's called, I, I think I'm going to pronounce it wrong. And I hate, that's the only thing I hate about vlogging is I, I can't. Say it right, but I want to say it's Mouvier, like it's O M E V I R. I know a lot of models that get on that particular cover or publish in that magazine, and I love it. <clears throat> it's got a huge following. It seems to be more of an upscale one. I also might reach out to Fashion Magazine New York City, which uh, I was on the cover of with my friend Tyler Gallant. Um, but it's more of a fashion magazine, and like that's kind of what I did with with um, with. Um, Tyler, but Kevin and I more just did like editorial stuff, so that's why I kind of want to go with this particular one. I mean, I could hit up all the same magazines I've been on, but I'm trying to. I want to get on different magazines this time. You know, I, I I love the magazines I'm on. I love being published on them, but I don't know. This one's just different. I thought I would do something different with it, so um, maybe that's what I'll do. I'll, I'll go through and see what magazines are submitting and see um, about this particular one. That'd be kind of cool to be on that. If not on the cover, at least in that magazine, especially with these photos of Kevin, because I think they're so awesome. And I was really focused on doing um, black and white, because he says, well, I, I've been getting this a lot about how people seem to like my black and white photos. But because Kevin is Filipino, he's got such great skin tone. And I was working on his some photos of him in sepia tone, because I've been going through the sepia phase. Or was it sepia? Anyways, sepia. And his tone is like amazing for those kind of photos those photos plus also what's great about it is he really wanted to do something a little more gritty a little more rugged and that particular um that particular edit when i did him in sepia tone i made made him a little more um contrasty you know with darker shadows and to me they feel much more gritty so i i, I can see why he's drawn to those ones and i was drawn to those ones as well i think they're really really awesome posted a few on my stories on Instagram to see what people thought and people seem to be liking him. So, um, I know he loves them. So I think that I might just do that. I might submit to this magazine. Um, I, I reached out to him to see what he wants because I, you know, it's a collaboration and I want to make sure that I'm maximizing the photos, you know? So, uh, anyways, yeah. So that was my, that's my goal is to submit some magazines. I got a couple photo shoots coming up this week. Starting on that one Thursday, one Friday. Hell, I might go see a movie tomorrow. What's out that I should go see? I feel like I haven't seen anything. I haven't seen Oppenheimer yet because it's been three hours and I know it's really good. I just don't know if I want to sit in a three hour movie, but I might go see that this tomorrow because I want to see it in 70 millimeter. You know, I just feel like that's something you got to do. Um, but the Meg movie is out. I tried to see, I mean, I was supposed to go see a couple of movies with um, Blake and I couldn't go, but. Uh, yeah, maybe I'll do that. Anyways, yeah, just a nice, chill Tuesday. It's getting warm again this week, so I'm kind of just staying close to home. 
And with the strike and stuff, I do got to go walk the picket line. So I'm going to reach out to my friend. I was supposed to walk the picket line last week, but um, <clears throat> I ended up having to work. So I think I might do that this week. I got to get get out there and, and be supportive. So, but yeah. All right. Just another Tuesday here in LA. Nothing too exciting, particularly just uh, living the dream. All right, everybody. Have a great day.